Hi, I'm Peter with Action Water Sports. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Cobalt A36. Let's go. Let's talk about hull design. Cobalt's built this boat with a 22 degree dead rise that lends itself to be very gentle in rough seas. Fuel economy, I've averaged 1.2 to 1.3 miles to the gallon, which really gives you a nice range. Also, drivability. This boat is a sports car to drive for how big it is. It's really a dream. Next, let's talk about propulsion in the stern of the boat. Cobalt offers the A36 with two engine options. Both are based off the 6.2 liter V8. The first is 380 horsepower and the step up is to 430 horsepower. I found that with the 380s, this boat will top out around 50 miles an hour, which is quite fun. It is a twin engine boat and we have equipped this boat with the joystick, which makes around the dock, your slip, by the fuel dock, very effortless. Uh, the boat is extremely maneuverable in tight quarters and it's really a dream to drive. Let's talk about the swim platform. It is a standard hydraulic swim platform. It will go down a little bit lower than this and you'll find that it's below the water line which makes getting back into the boat when you're swimming very easy. Our customers love this. Um, even the family pet can board the boat with little assistance. It does as well have a boarding ladder which just gives you more purchase to climb up onto the boat when it's in the water. Next, let's move into the boat and take a look at some more features. We're on the sun pad of the A36 now. Let's talk about the seating. It's convertible to where you can sit back to back with the people that are in the cockpit, or you can lay it flat. And then it's a very comfortable place to lounge and catch some rays. You'll find the shore power connections here as well. There are two 30 amp shore power. It's only necessary to use both if you want to use the grill and the air conditioning at the same time. Let's move over to the starboard side of the boat. This boat is equipped with a shower, which is a great place to wash off any dirt or sand before getting into the boat. You'll also find a remote for the stereo, as well as controls for the swim platform and the lights. Let's move forward into the cockpit. Coming aboard, you'll find the battery switches are located here, which is very convenient. This boat is equipped with the wet bar, complete with storage, refrigerator, sink, grill, and television. A removable table in the cockpit. All in all, the cockpit is the heartbeat of the boat. A great place to entertain, you can catch the game, grill some food, have some drinks, and enjoy an awesome time on the water. Let's keep moving forward. In-floor storage here is big enough for fenders, extra docking lines, great storage there. Storage here for small items like your wallet or your keys. And even a clever little storage compartment built into the seat back. Let's talk about the hard top. Not only is it stylish, but it's packed with some awesome features such as a sunroof, LED lighting, built-in speakers, and is also an attachment point for your canvas, but we'll get back to that. Let's move forward to passenger seating in the head. Let's talk about passenger seating in the head. Wide enough for two people, bolstered seating, with a flip down step, which makes it really easy to get up onto the bolster. This really adds to your view while you're underway. Moving into the head, quite a spacious area. I'm six foot two and I have no problems getting in and out. Currently set up as a changing room, you can easily remove that pad and use the head. Closing the door, you'll find two storage places that our customers love. Great place to put your phone and even big enough to put a purse here. Let's move forward to the bow. As we move forward to the bow, this is a great time to explain some of the features that our customers really have learned to love about the boat. As it sits right now, you're completely closed off from the elements. You're not gonna have air passing through and that's very comfortable on long voyages. If you wish to get some ventilation, you can slide this window up, open the butterfly doors, and you'll get a lot of pass through. Moving on into the bow, We'll open up the windshield and you have a plenty wide thoroughfare to get to the bow. Let's go. Very comfortable sun pad. Plenty of room for a lot of people to lay out and also gives you great access to where the windlass is. This boat is equipped with the remote that also has a chain counter which makes anchoring a breeze. 
Let's move back to the helm. At the helm, we find the seats much like the passenger side, wide enough for two people and bolstered. There's also a flip down standing bolster which can really aid visibility while underway. We have the Rockford Fosgate head unit with Bluetooth connectivity. Garmin multifunction displays. This boat's equipped with a 12 inch, 16s are optional. Other boat controls such as lights, blower, uh, swim platform lights, etc. Ignition, horn, remote for the spotlight, controls for the RGB lighting. Let's move over to the other side. Here you'll find a vent for the heating and the air conditioning, the Lenco Auto Glide system, remote for the windlass, seat controls, auxiliary inputs for the stereo, your throttles with active trim and cruise control, joystick for your tight maneuverability, VHF radio, generator controls, and fire suppression system. Let's end in the cabin. Like after a long day on the water, let's end this walkthrough in the cabin. This space can be secured, flips open, and stows to the side. Let's move in. Again, I'm six foot two and I have plenty of headroom in here. The V berth is spacious. This will slide out and give you even more foot room. Storage underneath as well as storage under these seats as well as in the above head cabinetry. Let's take a look at the other controls in the cabin. Here you'll find controls for the boat's lights, battery level indicators, other electrical diagnostics, HVAC system, another stereo remote, controls for your shore power and generator systems as well as the 12 volt, 110 outlets, Blu-ray, television, our customers have found that Cobalt's packed so many options into the boat, you're gonna stay entertained while on the water. With the available enclosure, you can zip in panels that are clear, as well as have drop-in curtains off the aft that will enclose the boat fully. Our customers love this, especially for staying aboard the boat overnight or on cold days where you really wanna moderate the temperature inside the boat. Thank you for watching this video, and if you have any more questions, feel free to contact your local Action Water Sports. Thanks again, and we'll see you on the water. Thank you.